your hand on your heart. What if we have a sweatshirt of Cub Scouts? Then put your hand on your heart. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United, United States, States of America, America. and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Very good. And then usually what they say in Scouts is they say two, and then you can put your hand down. That's what they usually say. Who wants to do the Scout Oh. See your book. <laughs> How about you do the oath, and then we'll have Liv do the law. Graham, you want to do the oath? Okay. Signs up. I will do my best to do my duty, to honor my country, and to obey the Scout law, to help other people. To help other people at all times, keep myself physically strong, mentally awake, and morally straight. Very good. What is the Scout motto? Just say it, just say it. Yeah. 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 There you go, good. And now the Scout Law Live. Can you lead us in Scout Law? A Scout is loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. Very good, everyone. Okay, today we're doing a bear goes fishing. And to do that, we need to go down to the river. Down by the river. Can we catch a fishing? Down to the river. So there are some fishing rules in the state of Indiana. One second, Isaac, can you talk? As soon as I get done. There are some rules in the state of Indiana about how uh, licensing works, okay? You have to have a license. One second, bud. You have to have a license to fish in the state of Indiana unless you were born before 1943. So if you're 87 years old or if you're under 18, you don't need a license. Uh, or if you're uh, blind or mentally or physically impaired, you don't need to um, you don't need to get a license. If you do need to get a license, which is like all of your parents here, we would all need to get licenses. It's about $17 a year for the license. And then you have to pay additional if you're going to catch trout or salmon, which are like the big sport fish, because the state uses that money to restock the fish. So most of the fish every year, the you know state, state of Indiana will go down and, you know and put a lot of wait, yeah, put a lot of like fish eggs down there, and that's why we have 57 different varieties of fish in the White River. So you guys know fishers? Hang on, fisher. No, that's not fisher is the last name. But yeah. Um, so um, when we catch a fish, can we bring it home? And cook it? You can once. Once a month, you can. So there's a there's a, a a problem. Like you remember how I said there was a company that dumped a lot of chemicals into the White River. Well, one of the chemicals that's really prevalent in our water is mercury. And mercury, you can eat fish and then get mercury in your blood. And mercury is really tough for little kids because it stops your brain from present prevent from developing correctly. So we just go crazy. It doesn't make you go crazy, it just makes your brain not develop like the, the right hatter. way. He went crazy. The Mad Hatter. Was is it great. deadly? Was a mercury poison. Yes, mercury it is deadly. So who can't eat fish, right? Who's who's a specialty population that shouldn't eat fish? Kids. Kids. Yes, kids should not eat fish until it's boys until you're 15. Baby! Years. And it's it's a little you can eat a little bit. They recommend one fish a month is okay. One fish a month is okay. All right, can but I not eat not more than that. One fish a month. And what about, uh, so boys under 15, they say, are, are uh, need to be careful. What about girls, girls? all the way up until they're 50. Girls all the way until after you're done having kids. That's why, because it's really, really dangerous for babies. So they say, uh, and if you're 50 and still thinking about having kids, then you're still not supposed to eat more than a fish a month. So one fish a month is kind of the one, one like caught locally in the river, one fish a month, that's the, uh, that's kind of the catch. That's why I don't eat fish. <laughs> well, you can have fish, just like one a month. That's so can we And you can buy it, you can buy it from the store that doesn't have mercury and things like that, but it's much safer. Um, can we catch Honey, I can't All right, I need some parent volunteers or, or people to pair off, that's fine. I need a few feet around me. I need a few feet around me because I have a knife. Back up, back up, back up.
Make sure you're with your parent or you're someplace. I'm gonna hand you a hey, string. Hey, go to under if there's a fish. I'm gonna hand you some fishing line. And Mr. Jerry's gonna give you a, a hook and then we'll get started. Perhaps you're sick. Hey, it's a thank you. You're right, we haven't done that unit yet. Mr. Hydeway hasn't taught us that unit yet. Come on, man. Yeah, he's like, you're going to teach him a pocket knife. Because you use a pocket knife. Reminder, get your pocket knife. A couple more weeks. Yeah, we got to get your pocket knife. Fish, come to me. So what I what I do for the bobber usually when you're fishing is go through the bobber and then back around the top and back through the bobber. Yeah. Okay. Just one at a time, but you can get a door in here and take another house. 